The insurance industry recently began testing headlights on cars and trucks, and it is not a pretty picture. Here's transportation correspondent Chris Van Cleve. Researchers at the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety say this is the type of headlight every car should have. Potential obstacles and the fence are clearly visible. Now, look below. You can barely see them. And this is the view many drivers get from their headlights. Matthew Brumbelow from IIHS. A lot of the low beams that we've tested, they just don't allow drivers to see far enough. The Institute began testing headlights this year, looking at glare and visibility. Out of 63 mid-size sedans, small SUVs, and now pickups with 152 different headlight options, only two scored the top or good rating. The Honda Ridgeline and the Toyota Prius V, both with upgraded LED headlights. 75 feet out, a driver in the Ridgeline can clearly see a pedestrian in the road. Two deer can be spotted 150 feet away. But in the worst performing pickup tested, the 2016 Chevy Colorado, a driver can barely make out the person. You probably shouldn't be driving faster than about 35 miles an hour with the low beams on this pickup. You just won't have time to see what you need to see and still be able to avoid a crash. While all the headlights meet federal requirements, such a poor showing in these tests will likely force changes. Ed Lowe from Motor Trend. We'll probably see manufacturers react and build better, brighter, glare-free headlights into future products. The F-150 from Ford earned high safety marks, but its headlights, Scott, were ranked poor. Chris, thanks very much.